Hello kids, this is Cascade and we are back in the game of Kenshi. We are at the very edge of Shim. You can see the Nomad Village off in the distance there. We have just been fighting everybody. You can see a group of my guys here. We've got starving bandits. We've got their hungry bandits. Who else do we have here? More hungry bandits. This isn't a hunger. Band of bones. Okay, burn. Why don't you come loot this guy over here? See if we can get some loot. And I got some bad news because uh, when I was away looking at my guys from uh, Squin, who were over there doing some mining and stuff like that, um, my explore team got attacked by some beak things back in Shim. And okay, sad now. Why don't you come loot this band of bones guy here, right here? Let's loot this guy. Oh, and you don't have room. Okay. So, anyways, uh, let me uh, see if I can find Agnew right here. Here's Agnew. And, oh, that's not who I wanted. Uh, who has Beep? Anyways, what happened to Beep is, oh, it is Silver Shade. Beep got caught in a fight, and before I could get back over there, his left leg is gone. So I'm going to need to get him a robotic left leg. And uh, there's poor Beep right there, and he has no left leg. He is crippled, so we will have to do that. So we had some, uh, this is the other group over here. I thought there were some Beep things over here. Here's one right here laying down. Uh, that is dead and just a ton of carnage over here uh, it's getting very late at night I'm gonna have to get some more loot let's see what Robert has got in his inventory he is full Van Zant. okay just gotta find somebody to loot the rest of these band of bones I wanna get as much loot as possible so far Orin oh how about infinite wing wang Okay, infinite. Why don't you come over here? Let's see. And as soon as we get some of these guys looted, we're going to head back out of Shim. We got to get to a way station over here and get some loot. And we will try to get Beep another leg. Okay, this guy wants to fight some more. And so let's watch this. And down he goes. Oh, Wing Wang. Look at his left arm. It is just dangling there. All right, where did that dude go? Did he roll down the hill? Where is he? I can see a part of him sticking. Oh, it's a hungry bandit. I don't want him. Gosh, where did that guy go? He, like, disappeared into the sand? I don't know. Who is this? These are some guys we already looted. You can see their gear floating there. Man, I wanted to loot that dude, and he just flat out disappeared into the sand, which is not good. There's Crumble John standing over somebody right there in a pool of blood. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. That is quite the scene. Little old skinny Crumble. Oh, man, that's a great shot right there. I love it. I love it. Okay, let's see. Do we have any more Band of Bones to loot? Infinite Wing Wang. Where did that guy go? Let's see if I can pick it up. Oh, there's something rolling around right there. What is that? I don't know. Look at that carnage, would you, ladies and gentlemen? That is some serious, serious carnage right there. Mm, that is wonderful looking. That means we're winning when it's not us that is on the ground there. Let's uh, get a zoom in here. Oh, that's pretty cool looking. Pretty cool looking as the stars are rising in the sky. Yeah. We are going to, let's see, if we can get any more loot, we will. I'm not worried about these uh, hungry bandits that are over here. Let's go see what we got over here. Well, 
I wonder where the cool moon is. Huh. I, there's like the Milky Way galaxy right there. That's pretty cool looking. Okay, I'm going to have to change the angle here. There we go. Wow. Look at that, would you? That's crazy looking, that beak thing laying down there dead. I think those are just hungry bandits around there in the night sky. I want to make sure everybody has their little lamp burning. Let me check everybody's inventory. You do not, Robert Plant, so we'll put that on you. Van Zant, Rain the Giant, you need to put yours on. Whoa, grabbed the wrong thing there. Didn't want to do that. Uh, I was sneaking on people and trying to uh, knock them out. Some hungry bandits while we were off camera, while I was off camera. And so, um, I usually try to dim the lights so I have better sneaking chances, but now I want things to be lit up a little bit more. Let's check my uh, gunners. They should have their lamps, at least the ones that have them. It would be nice to go to a high village and get some, uh, get some lamps. So, okay, what are they shooting at? Oh, it was a hungry bandit trying to get up. Poor guy. He is down. Oh, we're shooting at somebody else now. What is that that we're shooting at? Oh, look at there. We've got another fight here. Let's see if just these small guys can take care of him. Probably not. Ooh, who had the really bad arm? That was... Wasn't that Infinite Wing Wang? Yeah, he's got a bad arm. Look at that. We're fighting him here. Shim is just full of people. Well, oh, good job, Sad Neil. And there goes a guy rolling down the hill. That Sad Neil, man, that is one bad weapon that he's got there. Trying to train most of my guys on hackers and just uh, our small crew. This guy's trying to make a getaway. Um, we're not going to let him. Sad Neil. Come finish this dude off. Whack. Whack. And, oh, he's still going. Look at that trail of blood. Whack. Whack. That's a tough dude. Oh, did you see that? That was a leg or something that went flying off over here. Gosh, where is that at? That was wild. Absolutely wild. I loved it. And look at this dude. Yeah, it was his left leg. Sad Neil just chopped it off. Wow. Amazing. Where is the leg, though? I can't find the leg. Where did that one um, Band of Bones guy go? I don't think I'll be able to find him. So, I think what I'm going to do is uh, round some people up and uh, we're gonna journey on so let's see if I can get everybody here what time of day is it it's three in the morning okay pull back here get a better view and let's see if I got everybody and I do so we're gonna we're gonna head straight up here and then we'll head west we're gonna head north first of all and then we'll head west towards the uh, way station so people are going pretty slow right now I think somebody is probably injured let's see who might that be Robert's okay okay Van Zandt, Sadnail, Ruka 
Orin, Wing Wang, uh, Wing Man, you got a messed up arm. Oh, it's Silver Shade. Silver Shade's right leg. And Silver Shade is carrying beef. Where is Silver Shade? Okay, everybody's going to we get everybody to stop here. Why don't we come back this way? And I will get Silver Shade. Oh, is that a bone dog coming after me? Oh, it's a blood spider. Oh, it's two blood spiders. Oh my goodness. We are getting oh man, Bevo just gored them both. Unbelievable. Okay, Petey, why don't you go get Beep from Silver Shade? Um, Silver Shade, why don't you put down Beep? Go. And, oh man, what are we shooting at now? Okay, it's a hungry bandit back there trying to. Okay, uh, let's see. Um, who's going to pick up Beep? Um, let's see, Agnew, why don't you pick up Beep? Okay, pick up Beep. Come on, Agnew. Are they shooting at that hungry bandit over there? Is that who they're shooting at? It's hard to tell. How bad is this guy? Oh, it's something else. There is something else over there that they're shooting at, and I cannot see it. It's in the dark. And we had some blood spiders out here. I didn't think there were any blood spiders that were going to be out in this area. Okay, so we've got Beep taken care of. I need somebody to pick up Silver Shade. Why don't I have uh, uh, Burn? Where are you at, bud? Why don't you pick up Silver Shade? Where is Silver Shade? Silver, where are you? Okay, Silver Shade right in there somewhere. right there okay why don't you uh, pick up silver shade go okay good now we're gonna try to get everybody and head out of here let's uh, head north it is four o'clock in the morning it'll be daybreak I can't remember the region that's right next to the borderland but it just has a ton of hungry bandits like hordes of hungry bandits Please hit like and subscribe. This is my second playthrough of Kenshi. I started out in Cannibal Country. It was just uh, Robert Plant who was called, um, who, what was he called back then? Um, man, I can't remember. Uh, it slips me right now, but him and Lecco. And we got away from the cannibals and now we are a team of 30. That is as many people as you can have in vanilla. Is 30 people. Got two people being carried. I'm going to make sure everybody's checked. Yes, they are. And there goes my team. We're heading up. Looks like some kind of Skinner's Rome. That is what it's called. Okay, we're going to head up here a little bit and then we're going to head west. And it looks like a beautiful day on tap. Wow, that is really pretty. It looks like a tower off in the distance there. Oh, look at that. Nice panoramic view. Oh man, that is nice. The land of Kenshi. It is my favorite land. My favorite game. The land of Kenshi. It looks kind of like the American Southwest to me a little bit. In places it does. So, there is something off in the distance there. I don't know what that is. We've actually... Um, Taken out a couple of um, Holy Nation uh, structures here in Skinner's Rome. Some holy mines, I believe. Oh, that's cool looking. All 
Okay, there they are, the crew. The crew, or at least part of them right there. That's a nice shot right there. A nice shot. I love it. Okay, so we are going to, let's see, pull up the map here. And we're going to head this way now. So here we go. And they turn around and go the other way. So I shall follow them. And we'll see if we run into any more action. It's like the way station possibly up ahead. It's hard to tell. See some kind of structure up there on the mountain in the distance. Man, when I see this, it makes me want to go camping, but I prefer trees. Oh, there's a bunch of wild bull. Don't want to mess with them. You can see what Bevo did to those two blood spiders. Man, he's got an attack. He, he had like a hit level of like 150 or something like that, 130. Can't remember what it was, but it was pretty heavy. Man, those blades look cool, don't they? I love those blades. There goes Cornelius the fighting goat. The crew running. I love my skeletons, my robot guys. We can only get stronger once we get back to the hub I want to upgrade my uh, workbench there and then I'll probably do that off camera then we are going to oh here comes a bone dog okay let's uh, attack this dude right here we get a good angle here go Poor bone dog, he's gonna go down fast. And there he goes. Oh, crumble John, man, that dude is just one wicked looking dude. Skinny, skinny, skinny old man. Oh, look at that bone dog, he's got a couple of arrows in his head, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Okay, Pia, why don't you get some hides here? We're just going to loot as much as we can. I'm not going to worry about these uh, teeth. So let me pull back here. Get everybody uh, checked off here. And we shall tarry on this way. And tally ho. Here we go. Different ways around the rock. Can't wait, can't wait, can't wait for Kenshi 2. I usually, when I buy games, I wait for something to go on sale. Oh, there's another. Oh, that's Cornelius. I thought it was another bone dog chasing us. But when Kenshi 2 comes out, I might have to just uh, splurge and buy it. I would like to do a series on Kenshi 2 and... It's going to be so fun to play it through for the first time. First time you play Kenji. Actually, the very first time I played it, I think I had a character started in the hub and I lasted about 10 minutes. And my character died. Uh, but it was fun. Those 10 minutes were a blast. And then my second playthrough, I started in the hub again as a wanderer. And uh, that guy... Yeah, he uh, uh, he grew into a 30-person uh, team, and we went pretty far. We killed the Bugmaster, we were wiped out the Holy Nation, killed the cannibals, went in the Fogland, just wiping people out. Uh, uh, I made a mistake. Of, I think that's the way station straight ahead there. Made a mistake of attacking uh, the swamp. I wanted to take everybody out from the swamp and I pretty much did. I took down the whole swamp. Um, even a shark I think it is. What are they talking about? Okay I am going to uh, pause it here and see who's talking about 
what so let's look at the dialogue here so um, Agnew says gra ha 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 gra ha 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 whatever that is what is he laughing at okay so robots know what laughing is that's really weird but anyways um, I took out the swamp but in the process I actually took down some uh, tech hunters and I went to this one village I can't remember the name of it. it's kind of up in the hill in the southwest corner of the uh, map and the tech hunters there and people just aggroed against me and uh, I just got wiped out I think I had a few survivors I just decided to, to end it there I have that on a previous uh, episode though so we're heading to the way station and we're going to unload some gear and the main thing that I want to do is get uh, beep a left leg. So we will do that. We will do that. We'll get beep a left leg. Got everybody checked here. Let's see. We want to get up here. To the way station. Right up here. And that is a beautiful sight right there. Look at that. That's not bad. That is not bad. And I think there's a robotic shop right here. Let me just click on that. Yes, it is. Robotics Workshop, and that's where we will get Beep his leg. This will help him with speed. And here we are in the way station. And who has beep? I don't know. I better check again just to make sure what leg it is. Left leg. Okay, I'm going to send Robert Plant in here. And he is going to purchase a left leg for beep. See if we can get a good view of the, uh, the trader here. Skeleton Doctor. Do I need to talk to him? Let's see. What is this place? Got anything for sale? Oh, good. We have some stuff for sale. Let's go ahead and just unload some of this stuff here that we don't need. And don't need that. Don't need that. Okay. Left leg. Let's see what we got here. Economy left leg. I want to get a good left leg. This is high grade. Let's see. Oh, gosh. I didn't want to get that. But I just did. Let's see. What is this one like? The stats on it. It's not good for stealth. Uh, let's see about these legs right here. These legs are very athletic. Less for uh, it's a scout leg. Uh, what is this leg here? Stealth leg. Masterwork. 18,000 cats. I mean, we've got a lot of cats. Um, is this a left leg? Yes, it is. I might get this one. This one is just cool. Uh, not good for swimming, but I'm going to get this one for beep. Okay, that was a pricey purchase. So now Robert Plant's going to head over here. And I'm going to put him right here. And we're going to trade with beep. Where is beep? Who has beep? I can't remember who has beep. I think Agnew has beep. Agnew, do you have beep? Yes, you do. So we're going to put beep down. Put him down. Okay, beep, you just stay there. <laughs> Poor little guy. Okay, Robert Plant, come over here. And you're going to trade with beep. Okay, so here you go. Beep, here is your leg. Now we are going to uh, check out the limbs. And this is the right, uh, I think I put it right here. And ladies and gentlemen, meet the one quarter cyber beep. And he is up. There he is, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get a better picture of him over here. Oh, not you. I want beep right here. 
And there is one quarter cyber beef. Look at that little fella. I love him. Okay, we're going to end the episode right here with one quarter cyber beep. And until next time, this is Cascade signing out for the game of Kenshi, and I hope your day is a great one.